What up? What up, everybody? We got a good one today. What do we got? We got a good one. We got try to fall asleep. Again. Man, let me say, like, this game, this game is kind of, uh, kind of getting to me. Greetings, Mr. Heron. Thank you for attending today's consultation. Let's listen to what this How man's got to say. Has my little assistant, A.B., been helpful? Somewhat. Yeah, A.B. is all right. But it's been a few rough days, Doctor. I think it's getting worse. Yeah. The... Hallucinations? Y yes. Every night, they start to appear more and more often. And they've begun to attack me more frequently as well. Well, that is an expected part of your recovery, Mr. Heron. Some of my previous patients have had it worse. How can I be recovering if it's clearly getting worse? It doesn't make any sense. The human brain is an exceptionally delicate and mysterious part of the human body. To even attempt to comprehend its strange ways, one requires a fair bit of knowledge. Healing such a complex organ is not as straightforward as putting a band-aid on a cut. Therefore, brain damage so recovery angry, can sometimes seem unconventional. You went through a life-threatening experience, and you had physical trauma as well. Your problem is as physical as it is psychological. I strongly believe that the two are connected. Your brain will heal itself physically, mm. but your mind has to work it out as well. Mm. It's all about facing your fears, overcoming them, and letting the brain work things out on its own. Yes. These things take time. Face our fears. In order to succeed, man, it so. sometimes requires one to be okay. down a grueling path. It's merely just a fact of life, Mr. Heron. Not everything is as simple as it seems. I'm a man, so I'm, I'm, I'm able to face my fears. Okay, Doctor. We're not going to get scared today at all. I just wish there was a better way. But I understand. I hope you do. Mr. Heron, rest assured that it's for your own well-being. Now, is there anything else that you'd like to share? Well, up until now, I've only seen those hallucinations at night. Yep. When I try to fall asleep. But one of them has started to appear randomly during the daytime. Oh. Could you try to describe it, perhaps? It looks like a tall shadow with long, pointy fingers. It's almost as if it got burned at some point or something. Interesting, Mr. Heron. Interesting indeed. I'm not sure what to think of it just yet, but it might be a sign that your brain is... Mr. Heron? Mr. Heron? Are you... all right? Mm-mm. Oh, that just gave me the full body chills. Just, ooh, ooh, ooh. Here we go. Try to fall asleep. Let's go ahead and hit play here. Night number four. Skip the first half of a night? No. So, night number four. We're going to get through it. Oh, whoa, whoa, what happened? We're in the hospital? Oh no, because we were in the helicopter and then now we, cause yeah, I remember, okay. Okay, yes, yes. Cause we saw the explosion, then the helicopter came, we flew away on the helicopter and then. Hey, Mr. Heron. So, uh, about that consultation, that was quite something, wasn't it? I mean, you really caught Dr. Norbert by surprise. Got a flashlight. His current theory is the hallucination you've been having in the daytime might be the amalgamation of your entire horrific experience on that island. But it could be just a byproduct of the other hallucinations. Or it could be something else. On the other hand, your memory recovery is phenomenal! The amount of recovered memory is rapid. 
rapidly increasing. If we keep up the good pace, we might be able to check you out in about two days. Two days? Just promise me that you won't give up and we'll continue the tough road to recovery. Okay. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you promise? Yeah, promise. Oh, that's wonderful. I knew I could count on you. And by the way, we did try to fix that damaged lamp. But once we plug it in, it blew out the fuses to the house. So Fine. So there's no electricity in the house. Got it. Good. No electricity in the house. Let's just close our sleep. We're a man today, guys. gonna close our eyes. We have no electricity in the house, but the TV's on. We're just gonna close our eyes. We have a flashlight, though. Don't worry about that. Just close our eyes. Close our eyes. Close our eyes. We're gonna get through it. There was something there. Yep. Yep. Go away. I see you. I stubbed my toe. I don't know. That's why I, I did that. I stubbed my toe there. Just close our eyes. Close our eyes. Ah! Let's just. We're gonna pop a pill here and then just go to sleep. Go to sleep. What just happened? Did I die? I just died. What happened? I have to do that again? Oh. I think, I think it's, I don't know what happened because I, huh, weird. Because I popped the pill and that should have reduced the stress level, right? That's what I thought. And then, and then yeah, we hey, died. Mr. Herring. So, uh, about so, that consultation. That was quite something, wasn't it? No bueno. I mean, you really caught Dr. Norbo by surprise. His kind of fine. I'll just go to sleep. I think I cut him off, that's why he was just like left. God damn it. Just go to sleep. Just go to sleep. Just go to sleep. I hear something, dude. Just go to sleep. God damn it. Yep, yep, just close our eyes. Yep, 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 yep. Mm-hmm. 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 What's going on out there? Yep. Let's just go ahead and just take this pill real quick. 
Close our eyes. Close our eyes. I think our flashlight's wearing out. Oh no, we just can't see shit. Alright, we're halfway there. Halfway there. Oh god. Fear from the unknown comes from the darkness. Mm-hmm. Kill it with light. Yeah, yeah, let me just let me just just put my flashlight on it. Get it. Get it. Get it, light. Alright, go away. You stop that with that red light. You you stop that. <sighs> Alright, we're just gonna Don't hear nothing. Did you guys hear that? Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. I accidentally popped my pill. Something just attacked. Did you guys see that? Something just lunged at me right there. Oh god, just just I didn't get anything out of those pain kills. Painkillers. Yeah, there's a hand. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Hey, how you doing? How you doing, dude? Yeah. Get it, light. Alright. So we popped the painkiller. I think that's all we have. That's all we have. Just we got it we gotta close our eyes this entire time. Can't open them. gone Hey, hey, he's can you stop growling at me? Can you stop growling at me? Please and thank you. Go away. Oh. My flashlight's gone. Just close your eyes. Just close your eyes. Just close your eyes. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Just go to sleep. Stress level go down. There's something out there and my flashlight's not working. <laughs> I have no idea where I'm looking right now. I have absolutely no idea where I'm looking. Everything is dark. Everything is dark right now. I can't I can't see anything. Wait. I saw something. Bro. Okay. Alright, alright, now I know where I am. I can't I can't do anything. My light's not working. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Go away. Please, just please. Please. I see your feet. Please go away. Please don't come near me. Please go away. I'm asking you very nicely to go away. 
Please go away. Somebody give my gun. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it through the night, guys. I'm not making it through the night. I need a break. I, I, I'm gonna shit myself. I'm gonna shit myself multiple times. I need a break. All right, all right. Try number two. <sighs> Let's try to see if we, what we can do. Well, technically this is try number three, right? Yep, I said try number two, lol. After, after my break, we'll say that. Cause man, whew, after that, I, I you got I gotta save you gotta save the the pills, you gotta save the flashlight. Don't use them, can't use them. Hey, Mr. Heron. So uh, about that consultation, God. that was quite something, wasn't it? I mean, you really caught Doctor Norbo by surprise. His current theory is the hallucination you've been having in the daytime might be the amalgamation of your entire horrific experience on that island. But it could be just a byproduct of the other hallucinations. Or it could be something else. Yeah, we're just gonna... <laughs> we're just gonna okay. close Your memory recovery is phenomenal! The amount of recovered memory is rapidly increasing. Fine. Or something we just we, we got it we got to try to go to sleep as fast as possible man suck it up suck it up just go to sleep good we're doing good we are doing good did that drawer just open is that what just happened that drawer just fucking opened we're good Mm-hmm. 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 We're gonna have to get somebody to inspect that door tomorrow because it's still still creaking from last night. <laughs> really should get somebody to look at that door. That and that rocking chair that's going back and forth for some weird reason right now. Just go to sleep. Yep. 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 How you doing? You doing good? Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing good too.
what's happening. Oh god. Just go to sleep. Halfway there. It's 12 a.m., you know. Doing good. Hey, hey, you. You stop that. You stop that. Yeah. You stop that right now. I gotta save. I gotta save my flashlight, dude. Go away. Go away. I hear you. You are not slick, good sir. Go away. It's 1 a.m., dude. We're gonna shut our eyes. We're good. <sighs> you know what? You're not real. You're not real. None of you are real. Pop the pink. Pop the. Pop it. Pop the stress pill. We got it. We're holding it. <gasps> Holy shit! I think I, I stubbed my toe. I fucking stubbed my toe there. We're dreaming though. Oh my god, yeah, I stubbed my toe. There's, I got, the desk has these, the, you know, the, the desk has things on it. <sighs> really stubbed my toe there when I saw him. That's why I was making that face. <sighs> but we're dreaming. Oh my god. So We're Ethan and Daisy are behind it all. I need to contact the station on an outpost to call for help. There's gotta be some long-range radio equipment on this island. The outpost tower. Hmm. We got stuck over there in one of the last episodes. God, I'll be honest, that was that was honestly the worst night to fall asleep to, in my opinion. Like the last night, night number three was a little underwhelming, but the dreaming of night three was fucking woof. That was good. It was good. Um But falling asleep at night four. Oh my god, that was that was Tough. There's stairs somewhere over here. I think it's right here. Yeah. Let's go up the 
going today, ain't it? Well, the long-range radio is here. But some of the parts are burned to shit. <sighs> Damn it. What do I do now? What to do now? Be Mark's radio. It is key. John, please listen. It's all over. You don't have to be afraid of us anymore. We aren't going to hurt you. Our main goal is done here. <sighs> Keep lying, Ethan. Both you and Daisy have done a really good job of it so far. Listen, Daisy and I are both assigned for two things here. Eliminate the people who are dangerous to revival and test a drug. That's it. <laughs> That's the truth. The test drug, that didn't go as planned, of course, but the people who needed to be gone are gone. You, you were supposed to be kept alive for later examination. Oh, so all I am to you is a lab rat. And what, what happens you? when I'm no longer needed for this examination? Failed experiments are usually disposed of when they are no longer needed. And what if you and Daisy had succeeded in drugging me? What if the drug killed me, or drove me mad? You probably would have had to kill me. John... I witnessed three people die right in front of my eyes. And my own life was put at risk. Right. After going through something like that, do you really expect me to trust you? Your life was never put at risk, John. There was no gas in that cottage. It was just a game to keep you occupied. I died well, Thomas, I'll multiple times in his on that gas. I told Daisy, let's just end Tom in his sleep. But she really insisted on playing that sick, sadistic game instead. Mm. Something is clearly wrong with her, John. That's why you mustn't cause any more trouble. <sighs> sure. I'll be a loyal minion of revival. And not cause any trouble. You'll do anything stupid, or put the company at risk, we'll have no choice but to... Yeah, yeah. You'll do this, or you'll do that. I'm sick of your lies and games. Good luck, Ethan. Have fun with Daisy. <sighs> God. I do hope that my signal can reach someone. Anyone out there. I need to make sure that Revival doesn't intercept it. But before I do that... I need to get this radio equipment working first. Grab that key right the there. The underground facility. That's it. I remember reading about this island. They had a lab in plain sight when the island was still a vacation resort. This radio might have come from the facility in the first place. I bet there might be some spare parts for it laying around there. It's worth a shot. Hmm. This might unlock the pathway to the underground facility. Flashy light there. I said flashy light. Okay, flashy light. Okay. Are you trying to twist my words around on me? Yeah, this way. I saw the door over here. I'm assuming that's the underground facility. Looks like an underground facility door.
from I don't like how when we run the flashlight goes down. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's realistic, but I mean, I guess it's realistic. But like, I want to be able to see what's in front of me. I'm tired of stepping on that metal. Makes a really loud metal noise. Let's just go ahead and uh, just run. Yeah, if you can like not be making that screeching noise, that'd be great. Make some little jumps here. Look at that. You guys didn't see that? see that uh, we're just gonna jump yep jump 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 all right stop making that noise that would be amazing that would be amazing all right you're still making that noise you could stop that now just continue to make the noise you know do you boo boo you know no judgment I mean I am kind of judging you but you know do you whatever floats your boat bud it's a lot of steps like how far are we going down I guarantee we're gonna have to walk back up this bitch and I'm gonna be big mad I stubbed my fucking toe. With I stubbed my toe there, you guys. Yeah, that's what happened. Don't worry about it. Just stubbed my toe. I heard it. Do we go down or up? Okay, we definitely go up. Jesus, are we done with the noises over there yet? Or what? Ghost, I'm with you, bud. I, I wish I could go that way. Wait. Is this where we ran in night one? Is this, is that the, the, the thing that we ran, ran through? I think it is. Man, we finally made it. Shit. Took us damn near forever just, just to get through that. Whew, we're dreaming though. We're still dreaming. Hmm. The power is out. I should try to restore it somehow. I do not like the noises here. Hmm. My name is Michael O'Carell. I was a psychological researcher here at Revival's RL95 Human Reconditioning Center. Why in the past tense? Because when you'll be reading these pages, I will already be gone. To be frank, the probability of someone picking up these papers someday is very meager. Most likely that day will never come and these pages will rot away along with this foul facility. My hope is that someday these pages will be found by someone, but if not, well... At least writing these pages will help me to face this harsh reality and come to some sort of closure. Right before the end, I had to leave something behind anything to prove that I existed and to document what really happened.
I was reading something. I don't even want to read those no more. Looks like all the doors have been motorized security locks. Have motorized security locks. I won't be able to open them without restoring the power first. There's a map here. I do not fucking like this. Okay, you are here. Okay, so go straight and then to the left. Oh, wait, no, we gotta go straight up and then left, left. Okay. Oh, that's. Just gonna run. Just run. Way. I don't like this. I do not like this at all. This one's the only one that's blue. where we're walking now pretty much thought I just died there okay Let's see what happens Oh, so we basically have to hit all of them. Okay. Got it. It won't be hard at all. Next one. Should be able to just walk all the way around. Sick. Sick. That one's done. Next one. Stop that. Whatever you're doing, you stop that. So both those ways look crushed. Let's look up here, see if maybe. Do 
can do something over here, right? Two, all right. We got to get what one, two, three, four more. So let's just, I'm going to just go all the way down. Get all these. So we're just going to. Loving the infinite stamina. Keep that up. So to basically get the bottom one, you have to go to like the third one up. Bunch of assholes. It's almost like they knew I was going to be like, I'm just going to go to the bottom. Start from the bottom. You know? They knew it. Alright, jump, 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 jump. Alright. We need to go down one more. Get this one. What if I say please? Is that is that better? It's less demanding in my opinion, you know. One more. Jump! Yeah. Jump! Yeah. Oh. Main report system online. There we go. That should unlock those motorized door locks. Now I could go look for those radio parts. Man. Whew. Find the missing parts for the radio. Got it. Yes, sir. What the hell? I should keep it quiet. on the ground? Shut the fuck up. He's right there. He's right there. He's right there. Get in here. Get in here. Oh, fuck it. Go that way. Yep. You just go that way. You just go that way. Sorry, I didn't mean to blow it at you guys.
flashlight perma on now. We're just gonna walk like this from now on. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Just look at that goddamn glass again. Cafeteria? What is it? A little library. There's a shadowy figure over here. I don't trust those letters anymore, man. There's something here. I got a capacitor. Alright. Four more. Four more. I would read them, but you know, I don't trust them. I don't even know why I looked at it. Alright, so we got one part. Oh, there we go. Now my flashlight turns off. Oh, it won't work when I'm crouching. That's what it is. Yep. Yep. You just do your thing over there, bud. You don't need to come over here, dude. You just do your thing over there, man. Sounds like he's getting closer. Lockdown status has been lifted. Okay. Await further instructions from the base or refer to the RSRP. Alright, so we got the library, we got the, the power station, power room done. glass right there. So I'm assuming I think that's what that thing is. Alright, go this way. That's glass right there. Nothing over here. Storage room. Ooh, glass right there. How you doing, creepy shadow figure? Hmm. 
Just sounds like he's near. Is that it? Hell yeah, you got a vacuum tube. I don't even know what that does. Oh, hello. Hey, hey, hey. Pal, what you can I help you? No, okay. Bless me. Sounds like he's like right outside. Turn my flashlight off. I love how you can just hear the claws. What was that? All right, storage room is done. find three more parts so we are here we did that 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 we need to go to the other side and do that 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 so we're just gonna Yep. Transformer. Okay. Yep. Run! 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 Go! Go! Run, bitch! Run! We're dead. We're fucking dead. It's I keep. Oh, we're dead. We're just gonna run into this room. Close the door. Nope. I don't even know. What? What did I do? What did I just do? I think it just saved my life. I think that's for sure what happened. Wow. Play the game, bro. That's all I gotta say. What am I stuck on? Grab it. <sighs> that play, I, I, that's the two for one special right there. That's what I like to call that. <sighs> it's the two for one special. Cause uh, I don't know how I did that, but yeah. So do I just, so this was the same follow the light as before. So do I just follow? Oh! Okay, got it. Go, 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 go. Wait, that thing is dead. Yep, 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 yep. I like how they just kind of sprung that on you. You know what I mean? He's on my ass! 
this again? What is this? What is this? Man, this game is gonna kill me, dude. Okay, I don't, I don't even know which ones we've got, you know, because we just kind of like got a few of them there. Sounds great. Okay, so we came from that way. Where did we come from? I'm assuming we didn't do the subject cells. That's what we didn't do. For sure. We did the storage room. I don't think we did the subject cells. Did we do the water room? We for sure did the library. The lounge room. I think we did the lounge. Yeah, we did whatever that was. That's class. That was hella close. Is that it? Is that an item? Nope, that's a coffee mug. Okay. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Lockdown status has been lifted. Await further instructions from the base or refer to the RSRD. I think he's right outside here. Okay, so it's not the lounge room. Maybe it's the water room, which is right over here. Or the subject cells, which is like right here. I don't like this. This is the one with the fucking doors, isn't it? I'm assuming it, because that was the that was the fun one, honestly, but we failed at it a few times.
get it, get it, get it. We're on it, we're on it, we're on it, we're on that shit. Nope, 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 shut up. Get it, get it, get it, get it. We did not get the part. Okay. All right then. Well, hmm. Glass, don't worry about it. Oh, shit. Raising water oh, pressure shit. detected. Oh, Please shit. plug the water valves to prevent a hydraulic explosion. Oh shit! Yeah, 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 yeah. Spin the bitches, spin them, spin them. What the hell? Why am I in here? There ain't nothing in here. Did I, what did I miss? One, two, three. It's only eight, right? Maybe I didn't spin him enough? I don't know. Weird. Let's try this again. <coughs> we got it. We got it this time. We're gonna get it this time. Man, sometimes I swear, man, you be crazy. 
the last one. Time to get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of Dodge, bro. I thought I died. We do this way, right? Yep. Just run this way. I think it's this way. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck it. Run, 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 run. We're out of here. We're out of here. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Not this shit. I knew it. I fucking knew it.
I think you'll be comfortable here for a nice long time, Ethan. You really think I can trust the person who most likely just tried to harm me? No. I think you'll stay in this cell for good. God damn it, John. I didn't kill a single person on this mistaken island. Nor did I attempt to hurt you down there. I just... I'm trying to get you to cooperate. No. You just wanted to have me under control so that I wouldn't do anything against your interests. Am I right? Am I right? Right, 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 right. This is not even the main concern now. It's Daisy. There is something seriously wrong with her. We still have a chance to take care of her. We've had syringes that she got stabbed with. Ever since then, she's completely changed and become more radical. I'm worried that she might go further than she already has. There's nothing to talk through. I've heard enough of your lies already. Even... Even if that's true. I'll make sure- I didn't think it was gonna end that conversation. I was kinda- I was- I was wanting to hear the rest of that right there. Okay. Alright, game. Yep. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Just trying to get up the ladder here. All right. All right. Let's get this fixed. There. That should do. Now let's see who's out there. This is Pine Tree Island. Does anyone copy? Hello. This is Pine Tree Island. Does anyone read me? Is... is anyone out there? Anyone! Please! This is an emergency! Huh? What's this? chance to escape from revival how the hell do they already know what was going on fuck stuck, what do i do now stuck, bad. why did you lock up my partner john how rude and did you actually try to call for help on that radio fuck you daisy john i told you the only signal you'd ever get on that radio would be from revival oh and thank you daisy for letting me out you do know that contacting outsiders during secret research is high treason against the company, right? I'm afraid it's no longer optional to keep you alive, John. Right. <laughs> hmm. So you two are teaming up against me. <laughs> I do admit, you two make a really good team. Honestly. Despite the fact that one of you is trying to turn against the other. Isn't it right, Ethan? What an act, John. Don't listen to that liar. He's trying to divide us and create a diversion. Of course, Ethan. Of course I'm lying. Why on earth would you want to ditch Daisy to work with me? It's not like you didn't beg to let you out. Just so we could team up against her. Is this true? What? No, no, of course not. You really believe that nonsense he's spitting out? 
Give me a break. Well, all the proof was up there. Where one can see everything. The emergency system. When I turned on the power to the radio, the emergency system did too. Automatically locking the radio system to a specific frequency. When it connected, it showed a message saying that it had already been used to send an emergency signal. Now it is possible that poor Mark was the one who tried to send the emergency signal first, but I feel like that wasn't the case. I think one of you might know better. Mm -hmm. But if it was really Ethan, then wow, Ethan lost confidence in Daisy really quick. Shut up! Daisy, let's not waste our time with this. If we want to kill him, we have to do it before they arrive. Daisy? You... You didn't have faith in me? What? No! I have faith in you! I've always had faith in you! You got scared... and you lost faith in me. Th that's not true! I, I... You couldn't handle what was going on. Do you believe something is not... right with me? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I think you're fine. There's nothing wrong. That's a lie. Your actions I heard that otherwise. shit. I heard that shit through the radio. I see. That's why you didn't kill him down there right away. <laughs> it all makes sense now. Daisy, listen. Do you know how it feels when someone betrays you? When someone turns their back against you? Not caring at all for you? Come on, stop it. Where is this even coming from? Remember what we were assigned here for. We're supposed to work together. Hmm. All my life, I've been pushed around and used like a doll. It was so hard for me to change. I always lacked self-confidence and strength. But now, now it's different. I feel like I've broken free from the chains that kept me tied down for so long. For the first time in my life, I feel alive. Daisy, please, think about this. I'm in charge, you understand me? I fight for myself, and I will not let anyone push me aside ever again. Ever! Those who do stand in my way and let me No, I don't I think Ethan's dead. I think I think that's a fair assumption to to go off of there. You guys think so? Here we go again. No hallucinations this time? Hmm. Concluded in the full release. God. Thank you for playing the early access to try to fall asleep. We hope that you enjoyed the first four nights of the game and we released so many so far. We released so far, and hopefully night four was worth the long wait. Working on this game has delivered an amazing experience, and we cannot wait to di dive deep into the last two nights and truly, and deliver a truly satisfying conclusion to the game and its story. The last two nights will be released together in one big update. When its full release update goes live, the game will transition from early access into a full release. Everyone who purchased the early, ex or early access version of the game will get the last two nights for free, and the game will automatically update to the full release version. Fuck yes. Uh, yeah. So. That was fun. That was fun. Two more nights of this. Fuck. <laughs> well. 
when that dude does happen, we're going to be playing this game. And until next time, folks, I hope y'all have some fun. Because, uh, yeah, I definitely will say that I had some fun. So, until next time, folks, y'all take it easy because I'm going to be easy. Peace.